Knowing the Thoughts of a Person. Welcome, good day, and hello to Silent Time, the opportunity to think on what is really important in life. What would it mean to you if someone knew your thoughts? Would it be a comfort that finally someone understands? Or would it more be scary if people knew what is going on inside you? Some people are very good at interpreting, at guessing what is going on in another person's mind. Psychologists and so on, within a few questions, reading from the words, from the mimics, the person, how, how a person acts, the way a person acts, immediately they can draw conclusions. And yet, there is an uncertainty left. It is only a guess. It might also be different. God knows every thought, and that is indeed both at the same time. It is such a great comfort. He knows our thought. He knows each and every prayer. Even if we cannot speak it out, even if we have no more energy to form our words, God knows our thoughts, our prayers and everything. God also knows the evil things going on in our heart that cannot pass his judgment, that cannot go enter into his kingdom. God knows everything, but we do not need to panic. He is a loving God. With everything we can turn to him, with all dangers, all our fears, fears of famine, of epidemics, of attacks, of persecution, fears of getting old, of whatever it might be, all that we can bring to the Lord. He knows our heart. He knows our thoughts. Let's pray with 1 Kings 8, verses 37, 38. When there is famine in the land or an epidemic, or the crops are destroyed by scorching winds, swarms of locusts, and when your people are attacked by their enemies, or when there is disease or sickness among them, listen to their prayers, Lord. If any of your people, out of heartfelt sorrow, stretch out their hands in prayer, hear their prayer, listen to them in your home in heaven, forgive them and help them. You alone know the thoughts of the human heart. You alone know the thoughts of the human heart. Deal with each and every person as they deserve. Thank you for your great word, for your love that even though you know all our thoughts, you do not cast us away. You still love us. You still offer forgiveness. You still offer protection and help. Fill us with your Holy Spirit, that we may be shaped and that our thoughts may align with you, so that finally we may fit into your kingdom where your holiness reigns. To you be all praise and glory and honor forever. Amen.